Morning. Uh, evening. It's morning. I say this every single video. It confuses me. So it's Sunday and uh, the clocks did something last night, I'm not sure what they did, whether they went forward or backward or something. Um, I'm tired either way and um, I'm not feeling good today, uh, as in I feel like I've got a bit of a cold. <laughs> I think it might be hay fever. I've heard other people complain about hay fever. I think I might have got hay fever because my face is fucking itching. And I know I shouldn't touch my face, but I wash my hands all the time and I wash my face all the time. But Jesus Christ, it, my nose will not stop itching. I'm going to take some antihistamines today. Oh, hopefully that'll make it better. I'm sure I'm allergic to the fur on my bed, you know. Even though it's not real fur. Ah. Anyway, uh, heading off. My coffee's just boiled. I'll be heading off very soon into the Peak District, uh, away from the city. I'm, I've woke up in this road. It just seems to be like a drag strip for boy races and that. So the van's just been rocking all night. Loud exhaust going past. I don't know where where the where the uh, lockdown is in this area Sheffield but it seems after dark it turned into fast and furious anyway uh, the reality is starting to kick in a little bit now that there's a very good chance I may run out of coffee that's something I'm going to struggle to come to terms with uh, I have drunk quite a lot ah! I'm going to take some antihistamines for sure. This is not good. Don't don't worry about me touching my face. It's fine. Don't worry. Unimpressed Jeff. Not impressed Jeff. Hi, Deaf Jeff. However you want to call it. Said to me last week that this situation, this time, feels like the awkward time between Christmas and New Year. Where you don't know what day it is. You don't know what time it is. You don't know what's going on. You don't know when you're back at work. You don't know, you know, anything. Um... And he's right, actually. It does feel very much like that. And I'm sure that you can all agree with that feeling. But whilst we're in a bit of a shit situation, we need to be celebrating positives. And you might think, well, there's not many positives to come out of this. Well, there is. Because that awkward time between... Be, be, be queen? Tell what I've got on my mind. That awkward time between Christmas and New Year, you're allowed to eat chocolate for breakfast. And you're allowed to start drinking earlier than, than would normally be socially acceptable. So, enjoy that. You have permission to do that because it is like that time. So, eat chocolate for breakfast and, and start drinking earlier. Celebrate the positives, eh? Don't feel guilty for having fun. You will be over the moon when I tell you that the antihistamines worked. I'm not touching my face. Oh, now I've said it. I want to itch my nose. My nose isn't itching anymore. My face isn't itching anymore. And uh, oh, it's itching now. I've said it. Oh, it is. Oh. Uh, yeah, my, my nose isn't itching any, any half as much as it was. It's hardly, hardly itching at all, actually. And uh, my eyes are not hurting as much. So, conclusion to the, the, the eye issue and the face itchy issue uh, is some sort of allergy probably hay fever I imagine but anyway it seems to have fixed it temporarily but where do I get more antihistamines from that's the question I might just have to put up with an itchy face for the rest of my life uh, well at least until we're allowed, we're allowed to go to an antihistamine shop again we ever are allowed. It's 
snowy now. What the hell is going on with the weather? It was like, I got sunburned three days ago and now it's snowing. British weather is crazy. I just can't believe it. It's a bit windy up here. So, rain this morning. It's now really sunny. It just snowed on the way here. And it's now really windy. This is what it's like being British for all you people that aren't British that are watching this. This is what the weather's like. We get, we get, we don't get bad weather all the time, we just get all different kinds of weather, constantly. We don't know what we're going to wake up to the next day. Spring, summer, autumn and winter don't count in England. They don't matter because, Jesus Christ. It's going to be a long, long week if I have to stay here. This wind carries on. As if the wind wasn't bad enough, I could shelter inside. However, I've just realised that my uh, diesel heater tank is almost empty, so now I've got to go try and fill that up, which is going to be uh, a ruddy nightmare in this wind, to be honest. <sighs> posted the day when I was saying it's like summer and how lucky I was to live in a van during such great weather well it took a, a shit turn it's even just getting worse since I started recording this look <laughs> you meant <laughs> I'm right in the in the fucking Of, of this weather as well. We might have to move if it gets any worse. I don't really want to move, but we might have to move down to a more sheltered area today. A bit exposed here. At least my heat was working for the time being anyway. I might just get in bed. So, we're now, it's now like half past six p.m. Um, I've been in bed most of the afternoon, I'll be honest. I'm not feeling great. Somebody just told me, well, somebody just told me, I've just found online that having bloodshot eyes, which is what I've got here, is uh, an early symptom of coronavirus, which is a real positive, isn't it? Uh, anyway, changing the subject slightly. Um, faith in humanity has been restored a little bit. Uh, some of my friends who are out here uh, with me Went out for a walk earlier while I was asleep and uh, when they come back to their vans there's a, a bag of food and uh, uh, toiletries attached to their van 
somebody's a local I presume has been up and made sure we've got supplies left a phone number and requested that we give them a, a call or a text if, if we need anything else how nice is that people aren't all bad um, I just thought I'd tell you that also like I'm not just reporting all the negatives there's lots of positives happening as well you know what I mean so it's a good thing isn't it I don't know what I'm going to do for the rest of the evening they've moved a little bit uh, from where we were uh, I've not quite moved yet uh, because well I was in bed uh, they've moved somewhere a bit more sheltered because the wind is howling like a swirling storm inside um, and you've got to keep it in heaven knows I've tried don't let them in don't let them see be the good girl you always have to be but uh, I'm going to wait here a little bit I'm going to text them and see if the phone signal's good over there where they are they've not moved far it's only 100 yards but it's in a bit of a a valley so i'm, I'm wondering if the wind might be uh, a little bit easier it's, 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 it's quite windy here. i'll show you outside again so the snow is gone uh but and the rain's gone so it's now dry out it's just it's just windy and i'm getting the full brunt of that wind um, which is not a big issue. I mean, uh, I've got plenty of diesel for my heater and stuff. It's not massively cold, but I might go join them. Anyway, uh, I'm going to call it a day for today. I'm recording. I'm just going to go chill in bed, I think, and I don't know, a bit of self care. Probably pleasure myself to sleep. So, just like any other day, really. I'll see you soon. Bye, Felicia.